A warm welcome to you all. Without further delay, we are pleased to introduce your new manager. Welcome everybody to a FIFA 22 career mode with Plymouth Argyle. I've chose Argyle because it's where I'm from, it's my local club, and we're going to the championship next year. So I thought it'd be fitting to get them there on FIFA 22 as well. And then even take them even further. We can get to the Premier League because they're massive, Argyle are massive, and we're going up. Let's get into it. But yeah, let's have a little look at the squad, see what we were working with. Obviously I know, but you guys might not know. Just want to see like ages of people and contracts. Just if there's any contracts right now, it'll be good to get the ones that I want on a longer contract. So let's get into it. Obviously Michael Cooper, he's one of our own. I'll go through all these and see what I want to do and come back to you. I'm going to have a quick look at our financial budget right now just to see what we've got. So if I can start offering people other contracts, I will. Ryan Broom, I want to get on the transfer, so I'll see if I can do that as well. So we're currently working with 1.59 million and 21k budget. I might alter that slightly, get a bit more of the wages up. Um, but I shouldn't use that much anyway. And I'll probably have a look at like loaning people in, potentially free agents, but we'll see. Ryan Broom is our first proper transfer. Welcome home. Broom. Right, so that, now that's done, we'll get into the team, see if I can change the first team sheet a little bit, just to see what I like. Um, there probably won't be much gameplay of me playing it. I might take over corners and stuff, because they're the fun stuff. But yeah, I'll probably just be simming it and watching the sim go on. But we'll see. Let's see what happens. So yeah, that's the Mighty Greens team. I'll probably, like, I'm going to move Broom to actually be an actual cam with high attacking work rates. Um, and just try and get everyone's, like, well, not everyone's, just weak foot and skill moves up when necessary. Big Joe Edwards is our captain. Standard. Let's have a look at what we've got as a youth player, because I know some, they now do, like, one amazing youth player. Let's have a little look, because I'm looking forward to that. Youth Academy. It's a centre mid, Bradley Morton. Okay, there's some good ones here. There's a left winger as well. And a centre mid, that's cool. Bradley Morton's already 66 rated. With 4 star, 4 star. He's got 5 star skill moves already. we got some good players to work with here. Um, I'm going to sign Bradley Morton up. Already. I think I might end up signing a Jada and Fontaine. Possibly the others, but we'll see what their potential changes to when it's, it's been a bit longer. But with a Jada, I'm going to get his skill moves up for now. Wide playmaker? Nine weeks? Yeah. Let's get his skill moves up a bit. I do want him to make a... Uh, I will probably will turn him into a centre mid or a centre attacker mid eventually, but again... Do this for now. Cool. With that being said, Danny May is a bit old, but it's Danny Mayer, so I can't get rid of him yet. Because it's Danny Mayer. But we'll see what happens. Bradley Morton, you're definitely going to be on the bench. Sorry, Randall. My bad. Well, let's have a little look at our objectives and stuff like that. See what they want us to do. So youth developments, medium. I've already done one of those, though. Oh, okay. Domestic success is the main thing. So they want to gain automatic promotion. We can do that. We're massive. Win the title in two seasons. What if I'm not in there next season? Which I won't be. And reach round of 16. Fairly easy for that. I think we can do it with the team we've got. Cool. We'll have a little look and see what happens. I don't know who I want at the moment. I don't know like where I want. I've got... Hardy and Jeffcott and Ennis. I do have Garrick as well, but he's on loan. We'll see how well he does. But that'll be something probably next season or in, or mid-season, we'll see. 
What I always like to do with the career mode is, obviously, we've got one youth staff, so I'm just going to send him away. It's not the best, but he's good enough. Let's have a little look, see what he um, finds. We'll do England, because he's English. Um, I, I heard years ago that they find better players from their home country. So for this guy, he's English, so he apparently would find better players in England. But I don't know how true that is. I think it's all random, but we'll see. So I've just sent him away for six months, so mid-season we might see some new signings and I think that's about it we've only got 346k we've got 27k budget so I might look at loaning players but don't know where I need it at the moment um, have a look at this pre-season tournament see what happens then get a bit more money and see if we can sign anyone we want but well, not anyone we want obviously no Neymar at Argo yet Got to do some training first, and then we'll get into the first preseason game. Three A's, of course. I won't do anything less. I probably would, but anyway. Well, captain's message me. Let's have a see what he says. Just a welcome to the club, really. Greetings on behalf of the whole team. I wanted you to welcome to Plymouth Argo. Green Army! Future's exciting because we're going to the Premier League. Um, Bradley Morton, you're more than welcome. You're one of the highest rated already, so I don't see why I wouldn't bring you in the team. Give me a bit more money when I sell you as well, if I sell you. First game, ready to go. Let's have a little look, see what happens with the Sims. And it's live. And the game begins to an illegal position, we cannot lose to Power FC. We've got this. Lovely play. Let's keep going. Off to Jeff Cott. Oh, unlucky Jeff Cott. It's a corner. Oh, Jeff Cott. Jeff Cott to Broom. Oh. Shoot. Ryan. When Ryan Hardy missed that penalty against Chelsea. Oh. I could not believe it. I thought we were going to do it. But when you missed it, I was like, that's it now. We played so well against Chelsea. Can't believe it. I'm hoping if we make it to the playoffs and make it to the final, I can go up to Wembley and watch them. But we've got a few games left. We've got hard games left. In real life, obviously. Um, I'm going to the Sunderland match, which will be good. I think it's on Sky Sports as well, actually. So I might be on Sky Sports. And they scored. Half time, 1 0 down. Not great. Wilson's got a yellow card. Um, what I'm going to do is put that new guy on, Morton, for probably Mayor. Sorry. But yeah. Anything else for now? I don't think so. I'll probably end up taking Wilson off for Gillespie. But yeah, I'll do that for now. Hopefully Morton can shine. I almost jumped to result then. Well, using his physique, Come on, Ryan. It's up Morton on his debut, but not really debut, but you know. Well done. Get on, Bradley. Great management from the Swark here. Go, Ryan Hardy, yes. We've done it. 1-0 down. Back to 2-1. Back to 2-1? We never were at 2-1. On 2-1. Nice. That was Ennis with the assist again. I'm just a managerial masterclass. That should be it. Once we get this clear. Nice. Good 2-1 win in our first friendly. And on to our second game against Grenoble. Grenoble? Grenoble. Foot 38. I think that'll be a good. We can do that now. And it's live. And now they get the ball rolling. Nothing's really happened in the first 15 minutes, if I'm honest. Oh, they just 
Oh, good save, Cooper. He's one of our own. Everywhere we go. Here we are, the boys. Making all the noise. Everywhere we go. Damn. I was just singing then. Can we get an equaliser before half time? I think we can. Yes, we can. Big Bradley Morton. What a guy. I can tell he's going to be one of our best players. I think we might have to not play Graham Carey every match. Did I say Graham Carey? I meant Danny Mayo. Apologies. Graham Carey, what a throwback. Half time, 1 1. Do I put Bradley Morton up in cam? I think so. I think, looking at this, we need a centre defensive mid really. I might try and see if I can sign one. And so the second half gets underway. Free kick, I'm going to try and jump in and take it. It's a bit far out, really. But let's see. Oh. I missed. Okay. Not worth it. I think a draw is what's going to be. Please don't score now. Oh, they're at the halfway line. Okay. Well, at least we haven't lost yet. I don't want international. You're not taking Luke Jeffcott. Training done. Now on to the next game. Last game of the group stage. Oh, I was meant to go on team management, but I've just pressed skim. And it's live. Good save, Cooper. He is one of our own. If I'm honest, bit of a boring first half, really. Um, they've had a few shots, but none too scary. So, start of the second half, I've brought on Garrick, Morton, Lewis, and Sassignon. Good ball. Sorry, I was yawning then. And we scored! Bradley Morton. My god. What a guy. Good save, Cooper. Oh. Unlucky. So I've just brought Ennis and Gillespie on. I'm not taking off big Dan Scar. What a baller he is. Come on. Oh, I should have... Oh, he's done it anyway. He scored. I thought they messed it up then. I would have jumped in and just passed it across goal. But they did it anyway. And we've won this game, I hope. Good ball. Let's get a gun. Oh, unlucky. Half time. Full time, should I say. And that's full time. We won. 2 1. Good goal from Ennis. Good goal from Morton. Lovely. So we're into the semi finals. What I'm going to do now is have a little look at some players that we can get for a replacement for. Not a replacement, just a substitution for Houghton. Um, just because I don't think we've got an actual centre defensive mid like him. So we'll try and get another one, possibly on loan, but I'll try and find a few that I like the looks of. And I'll see if anybody in the comments could help me out. Okay, so what I've done is I've had a little look, did a bit of research on Sophie for just to see potentials. And these are the players that looked interesting to me. If anyone's got anyone else, let me know. I've put Jack Kovac there, but he's 31. I've got the rest are like really young, so I'll probably try and go for the rest. He's six foot five. This guy looks really good. He's got I think he had a potential of 82, 83. So yeah, if anyone can let me know any more players, then that'd be ideal. But once the scouting report comes back for these in the next episode, we'll probably start looking at trying to buy one. Hopefully we would have won the preseason cup and we can afford someone a bit better. Because some of these are out of my price range, I think. Like this guy's got a release clause of 1.35 mil. I don't have that, so hopefully the cup will help us just afford a little bit better. But we can only see in the next episode. I hope you all enjoyed. Please like, subscribe, and I will see you next time. Bye!